Good morning, world. Uh, I wish it was a better morning. As you can see, we're missing an awning. <sighs> so, I broke down last night, which I think is the distributor because I've done a bunch of uh, fiddling around and I'm not getting any spark on any of my wires. So, I'm hoping it's something reasonably <laughs> easy to fix. But while well, she was on the tow truck, during a windstorm, the awning ripped off. So, I just woke up. Now that it's daylight, I'm gonna climb up on the roof and see if there's any more damage up there that I can't see from the ground. Wish me luck. Okay, so, coming up on the roof, you can see what's left of my awning, which is very, very little, but I'm not seeing any broken solar panels, but it did quite the number on my chimney cap. Uh, poor thing. <laughs> Hopefully I can try and maybe bend it. Bend it back. Ugh. Oh boy. She's seen better days. Okay, well, if I thought it was flimsy before, it's definitely flimsy now, so that's gonna need to be replaced. And of course, just this alone is a hundred bucks. Thankfully, none of my uh, brackets ripped out from the wall. So, no real damage other than we're missing the awning, which blew away in a bunch of pieces. Okay, guys, well... There's the babies. Oh, Bobo, good morning. Anyways, I'm fiddling with the uh, engine or whatever you want to call it. I'm taking out the distributor cap, hoping, I have my fingers crossed that maybe the rotor broke underneath it or I don't know. I'm getting spark at the um, ignition solenoid, but I'm not getting any spark from the wires. So, I'm thinking my issue is somewhere under here. Okay, little update. I changed the uh, distributor cap and the rotor underneath, and lo and behold, she fired right up. So, now I'm just changing a few other little things that I had ordered a couple weeks ago that arrived today, like the PCV valve, I did get a new map sensor, but I'm having a real hard time getting that one off. I'm about to uh, Google and see if there's some type of trick to releasing these clips. And then I gotta crawl way down underneath, down in there somewhere, and change the O2 sensor. Smack the air cover back on, and we should be good to go. And it's another day. Bye. And we're moving! Woo! Nana's back on the road. Although, I want to say my misfire, that's what I've been calling it anyways. <laughs> I think it might still be there. So, I think the distributor is actually bad, but... I replaced the cap and rotor, and she seems to be going. I've replaced a few other things. I didn't get to uh, put the O2 sensor on because it's basically rusted right to the exhaust. You can't even tell where it starts and the exhaust starts. But, so far so good. Oh, from one issue to the next. <laughs> While I was under the RV last night trying to mess around with the O2 sensor, I noticed I have a big gigantic screw in my front tire. So, we're just here at the tire shop. Let's see how it goes. Okay, well, we're just leaving the tire craft here in Langley. It ended up being like a, uh, a short screw, so it didn't go all the way through the tire. Anyways, they took it out, didn't charge me a penny. So, I'm happy, back on the road. <sighs> Good morning. It is another day. Cloudy and cold. <laughs> but we just came by my friend's farm because I am scavenging some firewood and stacking some for next year because she had this gigantic tree taken down. 
So, we'll have lots of firewood next year, if I'm around this area, that is. And they're off. Fresh, where are you going? <laughs> Got the wood stove going. It is another cold morning here on the farm. But it looks like the sun's going to make an appearance. It's supposed to be a fairly decent day. <sighs> Look what I'm dealing with. I have a bad habit of putting everything right on the stairs and then it's always a nightmare trying to get in or out. Anyways, let's go round up the dogs. It's another day, ladies and gentlemen. We're just pulling into the gas station. I think gas may have come down a little bit. I think it's a dollar eighty-nine-nine. Was a dollar ninety-nine yesterday. So oh, it's come down a couple cents. I'm gonna get propane while I'm here. Oh, of course, I think I just drove right by it. Back her up. Okay. Parking brake. Say hi, Pushy. Say hi, Pushy. Anyways, guys, we left the farm earlier today and now we're just working our way back to Abbotsford to see Bob and Lizzie and have a nice little dinner. Precious, come here. Bobo, -bo. big boy. Okay, well, they wore off all their energy. Sleeping babies. So we are going to get on the road here and go and do something different because I've been doing the same things for the last, I don't know, a couple of weeks, back and forth, back and forth, rest area farm, rest area farm. So we're gonna head out of this city and uh, go over near Cultus Lake. So I'm gonna end this video right here. Go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Make sure to leave a comment down below and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye for now.